So the first fun fact, or little easter egg that you may or not know in Rec Room, is that your watch actually tells the time. So to do this, all you gotta do is open up your watch on the side, like right over here, and actually look at your watch in game. And it's different for everyone, but as you can see, it shows the exact real time in seconds. A lot of people don't know this, but I think it's a pretty cool easter egg, so if you ever want to check the time and you don't want to take off your VR headset, just do this. Boom, now you can check. And the second fun fact or easter egg you may or may not know in Rec Room is gonna be in Disc Golf Propulsion. Let's get straight to it. So what you want to do is you want to start the game, let the countdown go off, doesn't take too long. But once you're in, uh, do not throw the frisbee, okay? Do not throw it. As you can see right here, here it is, do not throw it. Take a left, back here. So go back here, go to the right, just follow my trail. You guys should be able to see this pretty well. Go over there by that waterfall, you should see a waterfall. Go over here. Okay, once you go through the waterfall, you should find a sword. Pick it up. Do not drop it or it may despawn. So the whole reason you want the sword is so you could hit the frisbee without it counting as a stroke. Which I'll demonstrate right now, you can see. I hit it, doesn't count as a stroke. So this basically means you could just go through this whole thing. And this isn't a bug that you cannot do because it isn't really a bug. They put the sword there to have people do this. I'm pretty sure since I don't know why else they put it there. So this is a pretty cool easter egg. There you go. Boom. And it counts as a birdie since technically you didn't throw it. You have to pick it up for the last shot though. The third fun factory easter egg could take place in any rec room original, okay? So let's get into this. I can't really show you guys right now, but fun fact. There is a chance of getting a bubbly from a box. Yes, a bubbly, which is worth a thousand tokens. So the most expensive thing you can get out of any rec room box that's given to you from the game is bubbly. And if you don't know what bubbly is, this is what it is. Here it is. And I got two of them. I got this one from a box. So they're really rare to get from boxes. So if you get one, go brag to your friends, man. <laughs> they're pretty rare to get. Also, you can pop them, which is pretty cool. Okay, let's get to the next one. Easter egg you may or may not know in Rec Room actually takes place in Stunt Runner, which is a pretty good game. So let's get right into it. Let's get started. Heads up, though. This little easter egg is on the last track, so it may take a little while to get there, but I'll just cut to it so it makes it easier for you guys. All you gotta do is you go over here, run up, you know, do the normal, whatever the heck you do. But as you can see, there is a waterfall over here, which most people just think, yeah, it's just there, because why not? But fun fact, if you go over here, jump onto this platform, you can go into here, boom, look, secret area. And inside here, you can find all sorts of <laughs> attire, let's say. You got a skeleton, just chilling, you know what I mean? Also, we have Dracula. We have some trophies. We got all sorts of stunt runner stuff. There's a column behind the couch. But yeah, this is kind of like a little Easter egg that I know it can't really help you that much, but it's still kind of cool, you know what I mean, to see all this. So, <laughs> that's this one. See you guys in the next one. You may or may not know in Rec Room is actually in bowling. So let's get to this. And in this game mode, little of you guys know this, but there is a super rare sweater you could win. It's a very hard to get, but if you play enough, you could get it eventually. And it's the sweater you see right here that I'm wearing. I don't know why I looked at my torso, but there it is. It's like, uh, it's called the bro sweater and it's extremely, extremely rare. It's a five star. Okay, so it's very, very hard to get. You can only get it from bowling, you cannot purchase it. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. This video is a little bit different than my other ones. Thank you guys so much for all the support recently. We've gained like 50 subs in the last two days, which is absolutely bonkers. See you guys in the next video. Hopefully we hit 350 soon. Peace.